police, we buy the dealership. Niggas sleeping on you till you kill a rich. Check out my demeanor, bitch. Niggas thought the king had fallen off. We believe this shit. We don't follow nothing. We the leadership. Black Wall Street. Money moving through this crypto. We just real it is. Stacking up the millions. Welcome, welcome to the Maryland for Crypto Show. I got my guy LJ in the building, my guy Money Meach. We're right. bringing it to you live and direct every Glad Tuesday to from Studio 202. And we're showing you everything there is to know about crypto. Because crypto is a new hustle in 2021. Shout out to the big homie Maryland for Crypto out here. 2 old, smoking with legends. That's how we do. Queens, repping for Maryland for Crypto. In New York. Yeah, yeah. we in New York. Y'all know what time it is. Y'all want to get your money right. Fuck with it. All day. Much love. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Maryland for Crypto Show. It's your boy Sean Prince in the building. I got my guy Money Meat. Yo, yo, yo. LJ Dread City. You are AKA know what it is. Mr. Make It Happen. <laughs> And let me tell you who's making it happen right now. Shout out to El Salvador. El Salvador uh, in America. Making the wave, my making man. the push for Bitcoin. My ching, man, ching. Bought, he done bought the do flag it. on the show and oh, everything. Oh, you know, yes, you know, I, got, I got my flag on today. I got oh, my El Salvador, you oh, feel me? Okay. Get my little shisha on. Yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's how we doing it today. We came in with that. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah. That's how we rocking today, man. Welcome hey, to the Maryland for Crypto. Show, we man. appreciate you. Hey, it's, it's because funny. now the IMF now has to accept Bitcoin on their accounts. So. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, definitely, Absolutely. Definitely. Absolutely. It's a major wave, major movement happening right now in the crypto space in Latin America. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. You know, just to uh, keep it rolling, there are a lot of countries that are considering Bitcoin adoption following suit with um, what the president of El Salvador, right. um, politicians from Paraguay, Panama, Brazil, Mexico, and mm -hmm. more have expressed that they are ready for Bitcoin adoption. Ready. They're ready to go. It's, I mean, it's amazing, yeah. man. And if uh, we here on the Mellon for Crypto show, Talk to if them. you mm -hmm. have not FOMO'd into crypto yet, we have failed, failed you. We have failed we you. failed you. Because this is the 13th episode. Shots fired, guys. Yeah. Shots fired. If we have not showed you the facts, the fundamentals, Man. the charts, um, all of it, talk to them. We failed. Because if you're real. not into crypto, if you're not hedging yourself, against the dollar by getting into crypto right now we have failed you yeah, and we're man. sorry i mean guess what but we're gonna do a better job moving forward look the dollar the value of the dollar is inflating every day right. every it's at day. like it's at 88 89 cent right now right somewhere now gas range. is going up yep. everything is going up yeah look cbdc's are being adopted every country is going to have their own cbdc central bank look, digital currency news is coming out daily they're they're progressing daily right Absolutely. and aggressively Absolutely. right they're progressing aggressively Absolutely. with this crypto space it's coming more to fruition don't wait till it happens don't wait till it happens don't wait till it happens don't wait shout till out to xrp happens. chiz he know what it is if you know you know but listen he knows man, what it is we right. gotta we gotta get on board with this we yeah you to. have to you have to i mean with the with the adoption that happened with uh latin america you know paraguay's congressman carlitos rejala mm -hmm. in a tweet you know, of course, he tweeted himself with the laser eyes. <laughs> yeah, he tweeted I saw himself that. like, "Yeah, I'm, I'm ready to go." Panama, you know, I'm, I have Panamanian roots, so I, oh. I'm loving that Panama is on board with this move as well. Right. Um, the Congress so you ready to go to uh, Panama and be a king? Out there. Indeed, <laughs> indeed. Gabby, I was going to get a Panama yeah, flag for today, with but I couldn't find one, so I had to rock with the El Salvador. I had okay. to go with my El Salvador. Okay, you know what I'm saying yeah, get my yeah. state P dip set going. You yeah, feel yeah, me? Yeah, I'm from, yeah. I'm from up top, so I had dip to rock. Set, dip set, dip set, dip set. What? <laughs> What? Wow. Yeah. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Brazil. Brazil. Congressman from Brazil mm -hmm. um, had recently posted a picture of himself with the laser eyes as well. It's Mexico. Mexico's um, governor. I think I'm, I don't want to butcher your name, but mm -hmm. he also said that he's on board with Bitcoin. Man, the whole South America is on board. South America is Y'all know y'all currency right is boo-boo. So listen, it's jump on board. Not a lot of people with, with access with to Bitcoin Bitcoin wave. Let's bring it in. Let's make the IMF have to take all this Bitcoin and add them to their to their uh, to their books. Mm -hmm. And guess what? Because once because once one country accepts Bitcoin on their books, the, rest the IMF has to guess what? Because they have to be that central bank currency to back up. You know, what I mean, El Salvador's uh, central bank currency, so they have to have that on their books as well. 
So guess what? That just opens up the floodgates for everybody to have cryptocurrency on their books. So at the end of the day, thank you once again, El Salvador. Thank you, El Salvador, for Shout not only leading the way, yeah. for not only being the the entrep- not the entrepreneur, but the but the activist, the the enthusiast to yeah. lead the way. They are not only adopting Bitcoin as their legal tender, but El Salvador will be using geothermal energy from a volcano within their country to mine Bitcoin what? so that it is environmentally safe. It's not taxing on the environment. <laughs> so they, so we, big, big we middle finger to Mr. Musk yeah. <laughs> for trying to say that Bitcoin was not environmentally safe. Check out El Salvador, Latin America, yeah. using that tech, yeah. being able to using take that, that to injuity. the next level. Man, that's why you got to look. Fundamentals. Yeah. Don't, Fundamentals, don't listen to what they saying. Pay attention to what they doing. To what right. they doing. Always. Because they telling you this way. But they doing this way, so they. That's, Amer- that's America his for you. His name is Naib Bukeli. I really hope I didn't butcher your name, but he just said that his engineers informed him that they have dug a new well within the volcano, and they will be using that geothermal energy to start mining Bitcoin. Right. I mean, it is a huge time to be in the space, and if you are not vested in cryptocurrency, you're living under a rock. Under a rock. You need to get with get the wave. Get out. You're an earthworm. <laughs> don't don't be slim jimmy yeah, slim don't, jim. don't be a slim jim yeah and you know with the, with the market Stop right being now a slug in this world it's um you know it's been at a it's been trading sideways it's been right. the bitcoin has been in in a channel that it just the forty two thousand dollar mark is where it needs to break in mm-hmm. order to go to that next mm-hmm. level so we've been trading within the thirty thousand to thirty eight thousand yeah, dollars right now we're at, at thirty six Roughly uh, thirty six six hundred ten somewhere in that range. So, somewhere yeah. in that range. Yeah, the mo- the whole market cap has been like moving sideways. Everything's Absolutely. been flowing between one point four trillion and one point six trillion. And once again, to We've remind people, that area right there for the now. fundamentals. All right, we're not in a trend or a downtrend because of Elon Musk tweets. Mm. Because of nothing to do with nothing, Mr. Musk. Nothing to do with Mr. Musk. The reason we are in a downtrend right now, once again, because we said it last show, so we're going is that because. These these contracts, these government contracts that that funds uh, 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 unemployment, that funds all these special projects, the PPP loan, all oh, those are billions of dollars that they we were they were giving out. That's liquidity that they was giving out to people. All right, guess what? Those people was taking that PPP loan, which is twenty thousand dollars. They buying crypto. They taking their unemployment. They're buying crypto. They're taking all. So all this liquidity that's coming in has been cut off. So now no more PPP loan. That's billions cut off. No more unemployment, extra 600, 300, that's cut off. No more, all these loans and, and contracts have been cut off. So if you're giving out billions of dollars and all of a sudden that's cut off, guess what's going to happen to the market? Mm. And that's what's happened. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. So around like May 1st and May 15th, those those contracts, um, Janet Yellen cut all that. If you pay attention, once again, we do our fundamentals. She said it was coming. Hey, these, these contracts will be ending May 1st. May 15th, and guess what? May 1st came, May 15th came. The, we plummeted. All right. So right now, we just got to climb out of that hole. So um, once again, we just want to re, 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 bring confidence back to the market by telling you that's what's happening. The fundamentals is what happened. Not because of Elon Musk. Not because of these cre- crazy tweets going on or mm-hmm. talk. It has nothing to do with because of China. Well, part of it is also because of China. You know what I mean? Cutting some of the uh, Bitcoin. Um, cutting the Bitcoin miners cut, off. Cutting yeah, some yeah, of the Bitcoin miners off. So that's big too. But with that included with regulations, included with, you know what I mean, liquidity, you know what I mean, things, that's what's going on. All right. Mm-hmm. So we want to just bring you up to speed of why we're still in this dip. And remember, this is a 40 day cycle. All right. So Absolutely. remember, we started about what, May, a little bit before May 15th. So 30 days would be what, June 15th. So we should be coming out of the cycle, coming back into the 20th, June 20th, into that end of the July. And guess what? We're going to be explosive, explosive. It's going to go <laughs> to the moon. The summer is going to, to be the a moon. big Don't summer. wait till it happens. Don't, Don't wait till it happens. happens. Jump on this dip. Jump this is the best now. time. Like I'm trying to tell you, if you're a newbie in this, Buy yo, you should be frothing at the mouth at these prices. What you, frothing all. What, what you say, Prince? Buy the rumor, not the news. 
Right. Buy the, the rumors, rumor, sell, sell the news. news. Yeah, buy the rumors, sell, sell the, the news. news. That's that's real. real like, life, I ain't never man. heard that when you like when you first said that. I never heard that before. But man, it, I mean, it's it's great practice to have, oh. man, because the market is so volatile. Right. And there's a lot, like you know, there's a lot of people that you know have, they're not educated in the space yet. Right. And that's why we here at Maryland for Crypto are here to give you the ins and outs. Right. We want to give you the ups and downs and know that the market, although volatile. It's the best. It's a good place to get in right now to put your funds because that generational wealth that's coming three to five years down the line is coming. Mm-hmm. So you just make understand. sure you're on board right. while it happens. They don't understand. We in before the banks. You get to invest in the protocol, folks. When was the last time you Talk invested right. in the protocol? Right. Where's my? Where's my where's it? Where is it? Right here. Invest, invest, invest in the protocol. And the crazy and the crazy thing about it is, it's like you can't kind of you can't go off of the history of it huh. because. There is no history of it. Right, exactly. Right. It's, it's making history. It's, it's all brand new. Out. This is, is pull them out. This, this is, is literally a, making history. First of all, this is that is the crypto dot com? No, 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 no. This is my business card. It's the business. This is the Maryland okay. for crypto business, business card. Account. But what I want y'all to see is that chip right there. All right. At one time, we had cards, all Visa cards, without that chip in it. All right, and it got mailed to you. Right, and we were swiping. We just whoop, 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 whoop. then all What's of a sudden, this chip? all Nobody of a sudden, knows what the chip they is. they sent us the card with the chip. All right, mm-hmm. and all of a sudden he's like, "This chip is for security guys." Blah 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 right. blah, and you gotta use it, and nobody else. We're not taking and swiping no more. You gotta use the chip. All right, and guess what? <laughs> we just accepted it. We're like, oh, yeah. we got the chip. We gotta plug use it, it in. Plug it in, and now we put a little four code in, mm-hmm. and guess what? We move forward. But guess what? What if we had a chance to invest in the chip? The technology behind before the, the chip, chip became the chip. Yeah, before the chip became the chip. Before they put the chip into the card. It's before a, they gave us all the cards. It's a great perspective. Because this, this right here, this is the product. All mm-hmm. right, but we're investing in the protocol, which is the chip, the technology in the chip. Guess what? If you invested in this chip, you're a millionaire right now. Salute to Talk you. To him. But guess Talk what? To we get the product. We get after they invested it in, after they put the chip in the car, and then that's what they sell us the chip. Say, hey, the car. They say, hey, you guys, you guys got a, got the new car. This $10 that we're going to take out of your bank of account. But don't worry. You got it's, You're secure now. Don't worry about it. And they give you the little, don't worry about it. Guess what? We, we getting the, we're getting the leftovers. Guess what? With, with crypto, you get right now, you're investing in the protocol, which is the chip, the technology in the chip. Before the banks, before everybody else, we're in it. Wake up, people. Hey, I got a question for you. And Wake this up. might be random. This might be off topic. But me and my boy was just talking about this. Let's do it. Who is they? They. Who is the they that we so commonly refer to? Yeah. Who is they? They. As the man. The man. <laughs> right. They is the man. The new world order. The All man. Right. The Which new is world the, order. Yes, okay. The, it's it's the, the, right. the, the most important people in the world that makes the decisions. The shakers and the movers. Yeah, the shakers and the movers the of one the world. Percent. The one percent. The one percent. When people ask me who they is, I say, they is them. Yeah. They is them. <laughs> they is them. And the if you invested in cryptocurrency, you will be the they. You right. will be the they. Right. Don't be the one of them. one percenters. Right. There it we'll is. be the new one percenters. <laughs> Don't be one of them. Right, we trying to help y'all wake up. I'm I'm a one percenter. I know I, I'm in the crypto already. I already know. Right now, it's only about I think there's only uh, what three million wallets, crypto wallets, or some totally. crazy like some crazy only like three four million crypto wallets around the world. And there's how many seven point four billion people around the world. The crypto market mm-hmm. as a whole is worth a little That's less than the Apple right now. Where mm-hmm. there's one company. Yep. There's Four or five million, maybe three, four, five million crypto wallets, but there's seven point three billion people in the world. Hmm. That's why we're the one percent. Once again, a couple million, three to four billion, one percent. Yeah, man, that's, that's I'm part of the one percent. I'm in crypto, baby. You already know what it is. Yeah, my don't. kids are gonna love me. My grandkids are gonna love me. My great great grandkids. Are, they're like uncle, uncle, great uncle LJ, uncle, uh, uncle Dread City. Yeah, uh, did my, you make my, it happen? My great 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 grandfather. <laughs> he invested in crypto in 2000 or 90, 1999 or 2019 or whatever. Hey, I did it for my kids. I did it for my family. There it is. Yeah, Curry's will own half of Maryland in the next ten years. I'm there trying it to tell is. you. And y'all be like, why do I see curries everywhere? Right, right. And that's what it's about, man. Right. You know, it's it's so many ways to capitalize in the space right now. Um, whether you're into real estate, whether you're into nursing, whether you have music on your side or you're an artist. There's so many different ways to, you know, 
take the crypto, or if you're an app developer, Fubi Token. Mm-hmm. There's so many ways that you can, you know, develop your craft and make that sprinkle, and, that sprinkle a little, sprinkle put a little sauce. There's <laughs> so many ways you can, uh, you know, develop your craft and you know make monetary gains in this space. And we here at the Mellow for Crypto Show, right. you know, we advocate for all the business owners and people that are making waves in the DMV. And so, of course. We got another special guest in the building oh, today. Oh, we got a special guest. We got a special yes, guest in the Ooh, building today. Yes, Shout sir. out to my guy, Donald Green. Oh, we got a Green? We getting that money? Mr. Green Investors. <laughs> okay. Mr. Green. Oh, he Came through the holler at us. Let us know about That's a great business. last name. What green. he's doing, green. Sound good to me because when the market is green, the market goes up. So I, I like Mr. Green already. <laughs> I like Mr. Green already. Right. So we're going to take a quick commercial break, and when we come back, we're going to holler at Mr. Green. He's going to let us know what it's about. And we're going to let you know how cryptocurrency can take Mr. Green's business endeavors to the next level. Yes, sir. Shout out Let's to Maryland for Crypto Show. It's your boy Sean Prince in the building. Let's go. LJ Dress City. You already know what it is. Money Meach. Welcome, 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 welcome back to the Maryland for Crypto Show. <clears throat> it's your boy Sean Prince in the building. Got my guy Money Meach. Yo, LJ yo, yo. Dress City, you a.k.a. Mr. Make It, it Happen. And shout out to my guy Donald Green for coming in the building and representing with us today, right here on the Metal for Crypto Show. Round of applause, man! Yeah. Round of applause for my guy. Yeah. Thanks for the invite. So. Yeah, definitely. We, definitely. We appreciate no having you, man. We, really. we we appreciate you coming through. You know, we're all about you know forward movement and forward progress in the DMV, and um, right. you're making major waves right now, man. So let's um let's tell the people a little bit about yourself. You know, a little bit of your background. You know, a little bit of you know what your what your business endeavors stand for. Let's let the people know who you are. Okay. Uh, my name is uh, Donald Green, and I'll, I'll take it back a little bit further. Let's do it. Yeah, so I um, grew up in the uh, Randallstown area, okay. Baltimore County. Okay. 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 Man, grew up to a uh, single-family household initially. Okay. Um, parents separated. Okay. Uh, left my dad. I ended up living with my dad, right? Okay. And uh, my mom moved to an apartment. <clears throat> my dad had the house. Okay. okay. And uh, that's a first, yeah, right? right? <laughs> right. Let's get it, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, like, oh, that's a little that's that's right there. Oh, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out to all my hey, man, continue, oh, yeah. continue. Yeah. continue. Yeah. It's almost Father's Day, too. Thumbs down, yeah, I know. I know. Yeah, yeah. She said she was, yeah. mom said she was out, she was out. Yeah. Yeah. You can't be mad at that, man. Hey, People, when your mind made up, it's made up, it's made up, absolutely, absolutely. So, um, so my dad, you know, I live with him, and uh, I found out this actually later. Is that he never paid the mortgage, like wow. the whole time. Like we were living the last few years, oh, he never so he paid. Was getting it. over. Pops was hustling. Yeah, oh, yeah. Was too. <laughs> he was doing something right. Hey, I'm hey, hey, listen, I want to hear more. Yeah, like, hold yeah, on, let yeah, the man yeah, talk. Yeah, I want to yeah, hear let more. Let yeah. Finish. Like, dad, yeah, yeah, so and, you know, when you most Americans when they buy a mortgage, you have a husband and a wife. It's usually two people on a mortgage, okay, right? Right, right. right. Those so um, yeah, yeah. So um, you know, it was up to my mom. You know, she wanted to save her credit. Mm-hmm. So she ended up getting remarried to my stepdad. My stepdad was in the real estate. I mean, I didn't know at the time. Okay. He used to take me around on his to, to his rental pickup. He would pick up money from the okay. tenants, right? Okay. Mm-hmm. But anyway, the the house was, went up for foreclosure, and they ended up purchasing the home, oh, wow. um, our, my our family home. And then he said, "Okay, well, they started their business. Well, we can talk about later on." But okay. when they started the business, he said, "Look, you're going to manage the properties now." So I became the property manager. Okay. So you know what? Straight, straight out of high school, it's great own to house. see. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Was, so you came to property man straight out of high school? You it was it was like what? first year college. Oh, okay, yeah, what college? Yeah. Was you know what, man? That's 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 the man upstairs, man, making the best out of right. a out of a, a messed up situation. Right. The fact that your peoples was able to purchase that home right. after there was a little bit of uh, yeah, a little controversy bit. with it, you know, right. that's that's a testament to you know being being able to to, able to, to sift through back the, and grab it. right exactly <laughs> to sift through the badness and being able to turn good out of it. That's what's yeah. up. I, I, I respect that. Right so what what college you say you went to? Cheney University. Cheney University. Cheney University. Cheney University. Oh, that's, a, that's all black college, right? Yeah, all black. Okay. 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 Another HBC. Virginia State oh, University. I'm Bowie State. State. Okay, we played y'all in football. Blue. I don't, I, I don't think y'all was on our schedule when I, because I, yeah. um, I played in, I played in 2017. Okay, but we didn't, we didn't have Cheney on our schedule. Well, <laughs> unfortunately, mm. you know, Cheney had to cancel their football program. Oh, yeah. 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 that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, dang, was you that bad? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <I was> like, <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> right, like, Cheney. He they said, said that. He said like, Mr. He, Green came like, on the field. He, he said that like he knew exactly why. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> he, he got some insider well, info. Some insider info. They were champions in this. After we were the last team, it was the last. Program, 
last we, of the we Malik ended then. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> unfortunately, I'm just messing with you. Yeah, yeah, but uh, so we, yeah, so Cheney State and then um, grad um, at um, Johns Hopkins Carey Business School. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. John okay. Hopkins different, Carey. Different, Different environment. Different Two environment, different yeah. Environments. yeah. It's like night and day. Yeah. Night and day. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I shout went to school. To, shout out to the uh, we be 21. <laughs> right. <laughs> 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 yes. Right. Yeah. The, the, the demographics are totally different. Absolutely. It, at Hopkins, it was I was actually in school. Well, my program was, was like. 90% Asian students. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, totally different. And of course, Chinese HBU, mostly African American. So okay. It, okay. it was it was different. Okay. One day we had to talk about that. But um, yes. Yeah, definitely, yes. definitely. I know they was all like, "What?" Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right, right, right. And now you're here, huh? <laughs> right <laughs> now. Nah, that's right. Like, yeah, now. Yeah. So let's um let's dive into a little more. So you know, I know you said you got a couple of business endeavors that you're mm -hmm. you know that you're doing right now. Let's let the people know a little bit about uh about Mr. Green Investments. Yeah, so to continue the story on, so um, after I started managing the properties and then we have a, we had a market like we have right now mm -hmm. where prices just exploded. Right, yeah, right. So right. my, my um, stepdad said, look, we're going to sell some of the properties. Really, to, they use that to fund their business. So, right. um, we what, sold, uh, What's the name of the business? Uh, the name of the business is PB Home Health Care Agency. PB Home Health Care. Yeah, we, we so, are uh, the largest minority-owned home care agency in, in, in Maryland. Ooh, so, in Maryland, though. Y'all yeah. hear that? Yes. Hey, That's we awesome. the first crypto group in Maryland. <laughs> they the largest uh, healthcare in Maryland. That's what yeah. we do. We linking up. Mm -hmm. Together makes family, baby. That's what That's we how do. That's you do it. I respect TMF, the You already know what it is. Every time. Every time. Yeah, it is, man. So, um, Bringing them heavy hitters out here for you. <laughs> Space cakes. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, keep going. Wait, yeah, yeah, keep yeah, going, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm in. I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm in, man. I'm in. That's all right. That's all right. I know, LJ. But, um, yeah, so, I, I, you know, I, he actually, we sold the property. I saw that check. I was okay. like, wow. You know, right, I said, right, you right. know, from where we started and the amount of money we, um, we he earned off it. I was hooked on real estate then. So okay. I've been a real estate investor probably um, since I, when I graduated out of um, college, out of Cheney. Okay. I started investing maybe about the second or, or, or third year after I graduated, which was, okay. uh, I graduated in 98. So like 99, 2000, I really started getting to Got investment you. investing in property so yeah so, nice so. nice nice so, so go, ahead. Go, ahead. go ahead and just to add on to that mr green insurance group um, we work with real estate investors mm -hmm. and uh key individuals of organizations provide key man insurance mm -hmm. as well as um you know if you're a real estate investor you have to have insurance to close yeah you know what i mean so we provide that for investors mm -hmm. so i have okay. a unique skill i'm sorry do you guys yeah. do you guys uh, mm -hmm. focus out of because I know Baltimore is a real hot spot right now right. for real estate. Um, mm -hmm. You know, the property value is down. And I think that, you know, with the coming with the um, CIAA is going to be coming to Baltimore here soon. Mm -hmm. A lot of, uh, you know, upkeep and a lot of, um, you know, up, uplifting, not uplifting, but rena innovations have happened in Baltimore City right now. So right. I'm just wondering if you guys are maybe do you guys dabble in Baltimore at all? Or do you see that as an area that can really be lucrative for the uh, real estate? Yeah. Feel right now. Yeah, I'm all, I'm all in, in all Baltimore. All in Baltimore. Yeah. Smart, yeah. He said, I'm already there. <laughs> See, said, I ain't even know. I'm already there. But my man. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> I, I'm not as much as I used to be. I mean, I, gotcha. because of the property values um, versus the rents, I sold a lot of my stuff. Okay. But um, my our business um, was really in Baltimore. Right. I yeah. focus in Baltimore. But okay. I think Baltimore. Yeah, link you up with Melissa, one of our other guests. Melissa. She's big in the winter stay too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Get, get the. Vega win out Vega here. Win, not win Vega. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Melissa, Vega win. Vega win. Yeah. That's what's yeah, we gotta connect y'all too. Uh, uh, so 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 Donald, just real quick. So um so what got you into uh cryptocurrency? No. What, what made you Wait, hold what, on, hold on. before even that? Okay. Because he's a stock guy. Yeah. Uh, let, let, hold on. He's what a got stock you into guy. stocks? Oh, oh first yeah. let's, 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 let's back it up. Yeah, for let's a back second. it up. Let's, yeah. Yeah. What, what, what got you into stocks? Because yeah. this guy is a big stock guy. What, what, yeah. So why um, invest in stocks? Tell us. After Chain University, I mm -hmm. graduated, came out of, basically became a financial advisor uh, for a company called Lincoln Financial. They're still here. Lincoln Financial Field in Philadelphia. Um, worked for a while. And um, then my mom recruited me. She said, I want you to come in and do sales uh, okay. for us. But I worked as a financial advisor. So oh. that's why I really mm -hmm. got into stocks. Oh, well, we are not financial advisors. Yeah. We are yeah, crypto yeah. teachers. There crypto it is. Okay. Teachers. Let's, and let's entertainers. Kind of, and entertainers. So, uh, all right. Let's keep it rolling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> not a financial advisor anymore. Oh, so, okay. all right. Okay. So, okay. not a financial we'll advisor something. anymore. So, but I mean, I, I say, why not stocks? You know what I mean? You, if you look why around your stocks? house, mm. all the products in your house, 
a company is delivering that through you, right. and they raise money absolutely through shareholders. Right. Absolutely. Why not own? Don't just you know you, you shouldn't be only on the consumption on the consumer side, right? Mm-hmm. right. You should be on either you buy it or you sell yeah, it. Yeah, you're on the mm-hmm. investor side. Yes, you know, that's what's real important. Be on the investor side. You know, if you want to, you know, they said the average income in the United States is like fifty something thousand dollars, yeah. which is low. Yeah, it's it's, it's tough. Like yeah. you know, mm-hmm. to, to struggling have struggling in these streets. Yeah, you're struggling. Absolutely. And, and um, but you can outside of that, if you become an investor in real estate and stocks, mm-hmm. have that your focus. You can grow outside of that. Right. You know, cryptocurrency. Yeah. You know what I mean? Invest in good assets. People. Invest in assets. That's Absolutely. Right. Definitely, Absolutely. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Cut definitely. the liabilities. That's, look, that's get what we, the assets. That's what we're here for. Yeah, we are crypto advocates, but investing, period, is something that more people in urban communities need to be on board with. We right. have to invest. We have to allow our money to work for us. It's... Mm-hmm. it's it's not talked about enough, and that's why we're here. We're going on wax every week right. because, mm-hmm. once again, we need this to be in more conversations and more households. And not yeah. only urban communities, just low-income communities. Period. I mean, because it's, yeah. it's just not us. It's black, brown, Indian, Asian. Like, it, I, hey, we... I, correct me if I'm wrong. I thought an urban community was a low-income Oh, I mean, but you know, when you say urban, they go, they, 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 you know, when you say urban, though, they think straight us, though. I understand. So, make, make it relatable. Yeah, so I just wanted to I'm make sure I'm like, oh, this is urban. My bad, y'all. Yeah. I signed up for my master's courses. I'm thinking I'm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Check him out. Check him I, out. I, I got him. Money me. Hey, money me. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, hey, sir. Shout out to me. Yeah, shout out to there my man. man. I want to thank me. I want to thank me for, you know, making my decisions. There it is. <laughs> it's like, nah, but for real, though, I appreciate everybody around me, man. Y'all been holding me down for a long time. So. For months and months and <laughs> yeah. months. Yeah. Nah, I appreciate it, man, for real. Yeah. Trying to better you, bro, man. Real, so, yeah. But my man Donald got a master's, too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're going yeah. to talk about that since we on that. Okay, well, but, um, let me just tell you a story, a quick mm-hmm, story. Do okay. I have time? Do I have time? Yeah, yeah, we yeah. always got time for stories here on the Maryland for Crypto Show. We got time. Let's go. So I had I had a quick, just quick story. Class. Um, called investments, mm-hmm. right? And um, we were talking about the, at the time Netflix. They mm-hmm. were trans this transitioning from the the mail in uh, CD uh, DVDs okay. to streaming, yeah. right? And then stock crater, stock mm-hmm. crater. And um, you know, my professor was like, I don't think that was a. He thought it was a dumb move, right? right? I'm like, no, I mean, it's, it's streaming. It, it was like the future, right? Yeah, the future. Right, yeah, right, the future. right. Yeah, that's what we do but now. I, I let my professor talk me out of making that investment right oh my mm-hmm. god so you know it's, it's not about just like you guys it's not about school you know it's about executing financially right, right. you have to you know like right now with crypto mm-hmm. right and i believe it's a great opportunity to buy right especially yeah, from the high right in the absolutely. dip right buy you, the dip. you get in when people are indecisive about it right or scared you know, or scared right mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. it's easy to get in when it's just flying up and everybody's doing but like when it's yeah, feeling we good yeah. yeah we're feeling good but mm-hmm. the, the time you can accumulate shares just looking at like the stock markets time to accumulate shares like a lot of even my real estate Mm-hmm. I was buying real estate, you know, five, ten years ago. Okay. Mm-hmm. And the market, of course, it was totally different right. than right now, right? Mm-hmm. It was totally different. So um, you can get in right now when things are, you know, kind of kind of indecisive. It's, you get the opportunity to get real value there, right. whatever you're doing. So That is absolutely correct. Yeah. I, more people need to hear that again. Right. Because, yeah. like you said, it's an emotional roller coaster. Right. And when those emotions are spiraling, mm-hmm. Once again, that's yeah. when you need to buy, not when right. everybody's on a high horse. Because right. when everybody's on a high horse, you 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 you, you just You've might missed lose. out. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, already yeah. happening. It's already, it's, it's already happening. High, you know there's gonna be a correction. Right. Yeah, so if you yeah. didn't get in before we took off, when you if you get in here, look, if we take off, boom, and you getting in at the clouds. Guess what? We are gonna hit the clouds, and it gotta be a correction. And guess what? It's going to correct and come back down to earth for a quick second. And that's where we're at right now. Yeah, absolutely. So you need to be buying while we're still on earth before we take off to the moon. And that's to say, to the moon. Yeah, you need to get in. Get in before it goes to the moon. You can't get on the spaceship if it's already in the moon. Right. right, right, right. Get, yeah, if it's already taken off, guess what? Before it goes to the moon. To, oh, wait, don't wait. No, so before it goes it. to the moon, let's, let's go ahead and help my guy, Mr. Green, out with this... Uh, <laughs> With this cryptocurrency and how it could potentially help Wait, take no, I his. Got, I got a couple more questions, man. Like, because okay, yeah, he's ahead. a stock guy, and so I want to make sure. Because <laughs> we always get this, we get this friction: stock versus crypto, stock he's versus right, crypto. Man, so I'm gonna take advantage of these questions I got. All right. All right. So, 
what what is a financial ecosystem in the in in the in the Sensitive. stock market right. and because we know what it is kind of in the end we're building this crypto ecosystem blockchains linking with blockchains and you know i mean other things but what is a financial ecosystem yes well, give us that my point of view <clears throat> is that when you invest you really should be looking at everything right mm -hmm. not only in the stocks not only in the real estate not only in crypto right. you need to build your own financial ecosystem according to your personality right right hmm. so me like this time this indecisive time mm -hmm. i love this time right because mm -hmm. i'm, I'm kind of cautious but when people are indecisive you know i i like that so i can really get in there right and feel like you know a little build, more build, build a build an asset build a, hmm. the my, i call my width right okay. right so Building a financial ecosystem is really all about learning how to have a saving system, right? Mm -hmm. Have a saving system and turning that savings into investments. Okay. Learning, you know, we used to do a thing at, at, at Hopkins called financial modeling, right? Okay. It's what Wall Street does when they try to uh, develop a financial plan about getting your money and taking it and invest it into the market, right? Right. Mm -hmm. They they financial model. They say, look, this is the future value. This is the this is the discounted value of an asset. Mm -hmm. They build a system around that. You know, Apple. Yeah. Apple. We talk. We the Apple ecosystem. The Apple ecosystem, the Apple ecosystem, ecosystem is real. Right. Right. I can't right. get out if I wanted to. <laughs> iPhone. Yeah. iPhone. Right. <laughs> iPhone. Get out the Mac. Be headphones. Yeah. Mac. Mac. Watch. Mac. Mac. Right. Watch. <laughs> Once you're in, you are in. It's hard yeah. to Either get down or lay down. Yeah. Right. My right. kids are in. My daughter is four, and she has her own iPad. She FaceTime me every day, right. like three times a day. Dad, I just want to talk to you. Like, the, the ecosystem's ridiculous, yeah, though. Yeah. Like, Once you're in Apple, man, they, they reel their customers in. <laughs> right. And they make sure you are all Apple. It's like, get not, out. Not just only. Thing like, and, and just to add on to that, <laughs> not only do they reel their customers in, but they make it extremely hard for all other users. Because, right. Right. because you you're can't right. get into no text message <laughs> groups. <Right. You're, laughs> your messages are you green. You can't get in no group you can't send FaceTime the calls. <laughs> you you got to download extra time. apps, right. Duo. You're right. My man my man been using Duo lately to reach out. Yeah. I do connects and stuff, <laughs> you know. <laughs> I ain't gonna throw y'all under the bus. Throw him under the bus. What he got? He got, he got the green. What's I, his name? I ain't gonna throw. What's I ain't gonna throw him under the bus set? or nothing. But yeah, we, you know, my man, cakes. they on duo. Yeah. You know, but, hey, but you, you my boy though. Yeah, but you, Al, you know we got you. But hey, you green, you a green bubble, man. Look, if you ain't blue. Hey, you ain't true. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't blue, you ain't true. Sounds <laughs> right. fine. I like that. But Check you know, we out. got you. Go ahead, but where? but to step back in there, you need to have a financial ecosystem for you money mm -hmm. just as apple has one to keep you in there right. you need to keep your money in your household you know rather you start out with your income from your job mm -hmm. you invest it in your business right. you invest it in crypto you invest it in um you know uh, stocks mm -hmm. and real estate and keep it inside your your income before you let it out because a lot of times what mm -hmm. we do is as soon as we get our money then we go paying bills right right mm -hmm. right so learn how day to by day right right, right. And, and check by check and right. you don't you never want to do that you know what i mean yeah and building that developing that system that's what i really do at Mr. Green uh, Insurance Group, we help people build financial ecosystems. Okay, so right? you're gonna help them hand by hand, hand walk, by hand, walk, 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 walk through the walk system. Through, walk okay, through. that's what yeah, walk yeah, them yeah, through. Yeah, Fine. Right, so real fast. So as you're walking them through, why real estate? Like, why? What made you like really like dive in? I know you said your dad showed you the the, mm -hmm. the money and stuff, but what made you like? You know what? I'm to just focus just on here. Like this is it all day. This is where I want to do, Mr. Green's insurance. Yeah. So money, if you think about it, money and um, investing is about time, right? Real estate. What What is it? Time. What? It's what was about that? Time. So it's the time value of money, right? I know. I know my guy, Money Mitch got his. <laughs> money Mitch. Come you got on, something money. to say about that? No. Hey, hey, on, hey, let, my man, let my man, Mr. Green, talk. Let him finish. Let him finish. Let Look, we ain't gonna go there right now. So <laughs> talk, talk, it's man. about time, right? So <laughs> if you think about with real estate, you're usually borrowing eighty to ninety percent. Right. So you right, accelerate. 80, 90 percent of the time it took you mm. to purchase that building, like right. hundred thousand dollars. Say if you have a hundred thousand dollar property, mm -hmm. you could probably borrow eighty percent on that. Well, yeah. think about how long eighty thousand. How how long would it take you to save a hundred thousand dollars? But I could get in I a mean, piece of real crypto, estate but one year. One year, right? Or that is drop <laughs> bomb. Anyways, keep talking. <laughs> That's right. I could I could get in a piece of real estate about twenty thousand, uh -huh. right? Twenty say twenty thousand. That's, you know, that that decreases the time by 80%, right. you know, of, of controlling the asset. Hmm. So acceler it accelerates your net worth, right? Mm -hmm. Because you think about it, if you go to your job, you got to save it and over time. But real estate accelerates that through the uses of debt, right? Gotcha. Absolutely, right. absolutely. So, and that's, go ahead. I was going to say there's several cryptocurrencies 
that can help accelerate, you know, your real estate business or your real estate endeavors. Right. Absolutely. One of which is uh, Proppy. Proppy. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Give us that. I feel like he's throwing money. me in there right now. Yeah, we is. Cause that's, nah. that's my man Money Meets. He, well, he proppied yeah, up. I mean, Proppy is a, uh, it's a blockchain technology. Mm-hmm. It aims to automate the closing process for all participants in real estate transactions. Because gotcha. that closing uh, process is it's yes. long, it's drawn it's like out. 45 yeah. days or something crazy. Yeah. Right? Um, yeah. Yeah. I'm so, going through it now. But yeah, oh. right. With the, the average time yeah. um, to close on a property yeah. is what, 30 to 45 days? 30, so. like, right. Like, yeah, right. Okay, well, this is, this is uh, the property blockchain. It makes closing faster, easier, and more secure. Mm-hmm. Um, it, helps, it helps brokers, agents, and title companies migrate a paperless remote closing. Right. Mm. Um, mm. So pretty much, we don't have to be there. Like, All the paperwork. As long as my information is on the blockchain. Fact, Maryland is pretty much like this. The real ID, right? When you go get your driver's license, you got a picture. Yeah, yeah. You got to get your all your documents to put mm. together, right? In a mm. row. Right. Well, Proppy's doing that for you. You're putting all your all your documents in a row for you. KYC, all, KYC all that stuff on the blockchain. So guess what? I don't need the lending guy no more. I don't need the the real estate agent. I can go there, be like, hey, I want this house. All right. Put my information in. It's yeah. gonna get verified on the blockchain. All my documents are ready. I don't need nobody. To be like, oh, I gotta go back and make sure. No, everything's been verified already. He gets it. Like, oh, you're verified. Oh, well, the house is a hundred and or three hundred thousand dollars, and he goes, "Oh, well, I have three hundred thousand dollars. Buy." And guess what? He goes, "Oh, sell." And guess what? It's your house, and we hand you the keys. That easy. It takes one day. It takes an hour to do that wow. when you're on the blockchain. Mm-hmm. It takes that forty-five days out. Guess what? My man Donald can be like, "Oh, sold to the next day." I don't have to be sold. I don't have to be in the forty-five day waiting period. Next That's property. instant liquidity in real estate. That's what's going on. Wow. Yeah, instant man. liquidity in real estate. Not just that currency Jeez. in real estate now. And that's mm. game changing. That's game what changing. that's what blockchain is all about. It literally in every avenue. It's eliminating the middleman. Right. It's eliminating Absolutely. that third par- party. And once again, this technology is being adopted daily. Mm-hmm. Like just recently, um, Miami's Beach most expensive penthouse was just sold um, in America's largest known cryptocurrency real estate deal. Um, uh, $22.5 million transaction all through cryptocurrency. All done under 10 days. 10 days. All That's done huge. under 10 days. They wow. they sold this property under 10 days. Wow. And that's a that's a record. They right. just they, they they just made a record for um for a tra- for a transaction deal in real estate. Right. Um at, uh, it doesn't get more clear than that. Once again, if we not have if we don't have you foaming into crypto, once again, we have failed, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> like what else do we have to right. show you? Like we are Kicking showing the you door away if there's a problem, for. cryptocurrency can solve it. If there's a financial problem, guess what? Cryptocurrency can solve it. Mm-hmm. If there's a real estate problem, guess, guess what? what? Property can solve it. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, crypto is the new wave. It's the new hustle. Listen, Listen as, far, got you. as far as the crypto game, look. Agents, brokers, they, they, they got to get on board or they're going to get left behind. Right. Absolutely. They're going to be out of work. Absolutely. It's as simple as that. Yeah. Like, and that's what a, that's in a lot of different avenues, right there. Right. People have to get on board, or they're gonna get left behind because it's gonna happen with or without, uh, without you. It's not. It's not gonna stop because we didn't get on it. Right. Mm-hmm. It's going to, this, this fourth industrial revolution is coming in with robots and AI. Mm-hmm. And guess what? And and, and blockchain ledgers. Class. So once mm-hmm. again, if you're if you're a self if you're a driver, a taxi driver, any all that stuff, that's gone. Uber drivers, they're gonna be gone soon because guess what? Retail workers, yeah, yeah, cars are gonna be um, what is that, anonymous. They're gonna be a drive by themselves now. Um, if you're a lawyer, guess Truck what? Driver. Yeah, you are gonna have all this. It's gonna be on the blockchain. It, did you do it? Yes or no? If Customer you did it, service guess what? Reps. On the blockchain. Mm. Yeah, right. You're guilty. You're gonna be able to put your groceries <laughs> <laughs> like, in the grocery like, cart, and the gonna... grocery cart will ring up your groceries as soon right. as you drop it in there, like, eliminating the cashier. Mm. Yeah, you don't want. We did it last week. You're going to. Just drop the groceries, gonna like, bloom. Time you get in there, it, it's automatically t- getting took off your card. I drop bananas, bloop. That that dollar thirty nine just came off my card. Mm-hmm. I don't even need the. It's just coming off. Mm-hmm. You sign up for it. You willingly drop. Uh, uh, you walk in, boom. Apples, it comes off. Mm-hmm. It's, I mean, that's the name of the game, man. It's it's game changing. 
It's yes. game changing. So let's um yeah. let's keep it rolling. You know, I know we got a couple of questions, a couple of folks in the group, or a couple of questions from my guy, um, Mr. Green, as far as you know how cryptocurrency can affect your future. And I know you got a couple of questions for us. So let's go ahead and, and yes. hit that real quick. Let's see what what Mr. Green's got to ask the yeah. Maryland for Crypto crew. Yeah. yeah. So you know me <clears throat> as a real estate investor, I'm always mm -hmm. thinking about how do you value crypto? Like mm -hmm. how do you guys and and then where you see it in the future? Like for, we talked about property mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. with with real estate, and I know people are using Bitcoin to buy real estate now. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. So, um, you know, where do you guys see it going? That's what I, I really. Um, yeah. Who wants to jump? I at? think crypto it, in itself is a store of value. Okay. The voice. It, it is. You know, people just like if I, I'm going to go ahead and do some branding, the Sutter Home bottle, right? Let's say the Sutter Home bottle. It's twenty dollars, right? Mm -hmm. It's twenty dollars in the market. So we go to the liquor store and we say we're gonna buy this for twenty bucks. We have given this bottle value. Mm -hmm. This value is now it's it's worth something to us. This value could I, I could take I could buy this bottle for twenty dollars and I can go sell it for a thousand dollars because the next person found that value in it. That's all value is, that's all money is. This it's exchanges, it's legal tender that we put value on. Mm -hmm. So if crypto can solve worldly issues and we as the a population we value it. That's when the market goes up. That's when it's worth more money. Preach. I mean, that's yep. and and that's really how I see it. Preach. Um, I see a lot of um, I see a lot of growth. I see parabolic growth because the market is still it's it's not saturated yet. The stock market is saturated over what eighteen trillion dollars somewhere in that range. Right. But the crypto market is about one point eight trillion dollars somewhere in that range. So I gems. I think it's gonna. <laughs> I think it's going to one day take off and it's going to be our new store of value. It's going to be the new currency. Mm -hmm. That's why countries like El Salvador mm -hmm. are jumping on board and making yeah. Bitcoin as legal tender. And guess what's going to be moving that money all over the world? XRP, mm -hmm. even though Bitcoin is a legal the tender, bing, 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 bing. XRP like is that. going to move that liquidity all mm -hmm. over the world. ODL. Man. So it's, it's, it's just about you know realizing what's happening around us. There's so many distractions. Mm -hmm. There's so many things that keeps not only our people, but all people distracted with with what the big wigs are doing with what the they are doing so right let's just get in tune man let's get into it and uh understand that this store of value is not going anywhere it's not going anywhere and it's and and just for the future of bitcoin i mean by the end of this year i mean this 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 year me personally price prediction price prediction price yeah, prediction okay i'm going now okay. this practice prediction once again is based off chart analysis right tmf <laughs> my man teldrick and my girl Nay, Black Sheep Cartel, those are our chart analysts. And we also going off fundamentals with N4C. Mm -hmm. I got Bitcoin with all that put together going to about 130, one, anywhere. I would 130 say, well, anywhere, anywhere for 115 yeah. to 130 thousand dollars by the end of the year. Going in, I would say, not just January 1st. Right, going into January, into February, because I, I feel that we're gonna have a strong push in the end of December that's gonna shoot through into like that first quarter of 2022. Hmm. So that's my slash Maryland for crypto. Um, stamp it, stamp it. 130, hmm. anywhere from 115 to 130. 130. Bitcoin. 115 to 130. And that's the range. That's fi and that's only 15,000. That and that's not a big range. People are like, oh, it's a big range. No, that's Bitcoin. You saw it drop 30,000 and. In a week, so yep. me giving you a fifteen thousand is good. It's good range. Mm. Where, where? All right. Do you have a price prediction for Bitcoin? For biddies, for the biddies, for the biddies. I love my biddies. Yeah, we know you guys. <laughs> so, I mean, <laughs> you know, with Bitcoin trading, it's been trading sideways recently, within thirty to forty-two thousand being that um, being that resistance. Uh, I personally think with the, all the adoption that's happening and. All the companies jumping on board and people finding that the new digital goal to be Bitcoin. Um, I'm right. I'm right on board with LJ, man. I think Bitcoin has the potential to reach at the very least a hundred thousand dollars by the end of the fourth quarter. Hmm. At okay. the very least. Okay, now your turn, money meet. Watch him. I'm so, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so conservative. I've never met Mr. nobody named Mon Money Meach, <laughs> and he's the most conservative. We're gonna dry Meach, broke me. He's too conservative. <laughs> for, for the record, I ain't never been that. There it is. Talk to him. Talk to him. Talk to him. Money right, Meach. Um, yeah, my price prediction. Mm -hmm. First of all, let me say that I feel like uh, 
when the market settles and when we actually uh yeah when the market settles from all of everything that's going on this bull bear market all of that right, right. i feel like when it settles again it's you know the norm for it is going to be this 30 to fifty thousand dollar range when right we come here. back down yeah when it comes back down okay, because so because you know you, you're giving you got, us the bear market yeah no, no you don't hit a bear i know market. i i said let me start by let saying man, this let money Jesus meet Christ. let me can i can preach I, can i can, I, can, can money I, meet can preach. i can i build up to my price okay, prediction i'm just saying i just want to hear some good can stuff he, can he draw the fans <laughs> that in? is good yeah, okay if you if you know then you know that for bitcoin to steady at 30 Forty thousand dollars. That's on the correction. What? Yeah. That's huge. Yeah, it, on the big. correction. It, this is the first year that's ever broken twenty thousand. Exactly. So and for that floor to be that. Exactly. Yeah. For okay. the floor, for the new floor to be thirty forty. Right. Talk Come to on, him, Mr. Neach. It, anyways, <laughs> my my Neech. overall price prediction. I feel like it's going to go in between. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna say ninety to a hundred to a hundred k. Okay, he said hundred though. Ninety to a hundred k. Yeah, he said hundred. I give him that. He's, okay, uh, he's being okay. all right. I thought he was like, like money. sixty to seventy. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh. right, we already hit sixty. Just about. My man, my man, mm-hmm. my man. Yeah, what man. about you, Donald? You invested in some. Um, well, matter of fact, we haven't even got that. What cryptocurrencies are you invested in? Mm-hmm. And let us know. Let let the people know. Donald Green don't only have stocks. We've brought him over to the dark side. Yes. So yes, on that yes. dark Welcome. side, what do you have? Welcome. Welcome. Bitcoin. Okay. Yeah, you got I the biddies. I had a good, big dog. I, you know, mm-hmm. I, I like the top. Okay. Bitcoin, okay. XRP. XRP. Um, Cardano. XRP. Okay. You got some Cardano. Cardano. And Stella. Oh, okay. Man. You got some okay. Stella. This man has good taste. Good taste. Yeah, has good taste. Called Cardano. <laughs> Cardano is where it's at. Like you got a little theorem, no theorem? Yeah, yes, I'm sorry, and Ethereum. Okay, yeah, got the Ethereum. Ethereum. Yeah, that's that's Sean. Sean. That's I, I, I was look, I was so going like I was, I was chilling, but I was going to say, look, man, if you got all the top coins, you definitely yeah, need yeah, to at least yeah. have some. Yeah, you got right, you gotta Ether. have that Ether. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Go ahead, gotta, say it. Go ahead, say it. I mess with your soul like Ether. Oh my God, Nas in the building. He knew what time it was. Made all that money with Coinbase. He was predicting this before it was even. That's my guy. Shout out to. That's how I'm trying to be with Ripple. Right, man, definitely. And even with Cardano, you know, just some price predictions with that. In 2020. 21 the price of ada has saw a major upward trend mm-hmm. it can be expected to result in a price of about three dollars going into 2022 mm-hmm. and um in three years Ooh. i expect ada to grow two thousand and five hundred percent in three wow. years due to the optimistic view that ada's blockchain will solve the problem posed by ethereum and bitcoin so- a- so in three years. In three years. So I need to go ahead and sign up for Meech's company. Let's go. I need, I need to go ahead and sign up for Hoddle Helpers. Hoddle Helpers. Hoddle Helpers. <laughs> I need, yeah. You need to be a Hoddle Helper. Uh, yeah, I'm coming. Or three you years, need to get with the Hoddle Helpers. I will be So there. we can help you Hoddle. All right. Absolutely. Look, I ain't gonna lie. I've been applying hodling everything in my life, <laughs> as, as you should, money <laughs> mate. <laughs> hodl, <laughs> hodl it all, <laughs> right? Yeah. Hodl, hey, hodl. Hey, once we end, we end. It change. Yo, crypto changes your life. You think everything now thinks about crypto? Man. Oh, we gonna spend groceries? How much we spend it? Because uh, we spend over two hundred. Man, money listen, could be XRP crypto, right? or crypto, right. like you know. But, what I mean? but I'm ain't. telling you, it's like building that ecosystem. Right? Right. Once you build yeah. that ecosystem, you're like man, you, you always want to. You don't want to divvy away from you. You want to yeah. divvy away, but you keep your money in there. Right. Right. Yeah. Absolutely, so, absolutely. got to keep up with your finances, man. Yeah. So, so like rent time, like, you, oh. you really need offer. You need a you need a business, right? You need. Some crypto, mm-hmm. you need some stocks, mm-hmm. and you need some real estate, right? That's the system. And a little gold. A little, a little gold. gold. I've been and listening gold. to the gems. And, 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 okay, yep. and a few yeah, my guy, Mr. You Green, is dropping Mr. on you Mr. Green yeah. is dropping and, and, gems. And I promise you, this is not the first time that I heard this. Coming from somebody who's successful, somebody who has their own businesses, somebody who's into businesses, the real estate. plural. Right. right. Somebody plural. who's into mm-hmm. the real estate game. I've heard this multiple times from different people of the same stature. Stocks. Right. Real estate, right? Get a business, get an right. LLC. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, that, and now we add in crypto into right. that, right? Because this, this, this is the newest baby asset, right? That has the potential to preach, yeah. Go past all of these assets, absolutely. So, and, 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 and a little bit of and a little bit of metals. Get some of those too. Yeah. But Precious diversify, metals. diversify. Yeah. Let's uh, let's get Let your money work for you. A couple of final thoughts, a couple of takeaways from today's episode. You know, we drop a lot of gems right here. We're gonna let our guests go first. Hey, yeah. I, I had a quick question. Yeah. You, What's up? You, um, What's up? So you said something about how Cardano is going to solve 
the problem that Bitcoin and Ethereum has. Absolutely. Could, could you get into that? I, Smart, contracts. Yeah. Smart contracts. Smart contracts. The contract. interoperability yeah. between different blockchains. Right. Um, with Bitcoin and Ethereum, they're a proof of work. Uh, so with that being said, they it takes a lot of energy, a lot of people, a lot of manpower to mine and produce these mm -hmm. cryptocurrencies yeah. right? mm -hmm. versus Cardano, which pretty much once it's in the system, once it's out there, it's out there mm -hmm. and it grows on its own. Mm -hmm. And developers can build their dApps, which is decentralized applications mm -hmm. on Cardano's blockchain, mm -hmm. causing, um, you know, pre and with Ethereum being that proof of work, um, mm -hmm blockchain there's a lot of gas fees that goes along with that right. cardano mm -hmm. aims to solve those gas fees uh -huh, and makes okay. it more affordable mm -hmm. for developers like myself fubi mm -hmm. token i'm gonna just drop Fubi's. that out there well, mm -hmm. one more time for the whole Fubi team, token <laughs> for the whole team. Do we, do we, we got that we got that drop i'm gonna just drop it we in got there, the, no we got the fubi uh the, the, the not yet not yet not yet it's all oh. good I'm, I'm just teasing the people they're gonna ask what's oh, yeah. what's fubi token well they're gonna figure it out when it's time to figure it out but yeah Indubitably. Hmm. Indubitably. What are they talking about? <laughs> yes. But so. yeah, so you know, I just think um, you know, Cardano is the future. Yeah, you yeah. know, uh especially in Africa. Absolutely. What is so so um Bitcoin Ethereum is, is run off proof of work. Uh, Cardano is proof of stake, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, Absolutely. I just wanted to uh, mm -hmm. be clear on that because I, I, I yep. you said it. I'm staking my Cardano yeah. as you should. ADA. Mm -hmm. ADA. And, and, and um Yuri Wallet. In case you don't know what proof of stake is, it's basically just uh, the networks working together within their network mm -hmm. to help build their ecosystem. Right. Okay. So how um, proof of work, like you said, they, um, you know, that's manpower. You have to actually mine. Mine it. Yep. You have to actually mine it. But with proof of stake, you eliminate that manpower. That and middleman. The, and the networks work together mm -hmm. to mine and, and build the coin. And, right. you know, and build, build that blockchain yeah, ecosystem. Build, build that the, network. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So, absolutely, cool, absolutely. Cool. Yeah. Um, so yeah, man. Any final thoughts and take and takeaways I mean, from my guys? Other than the CBDCs, I mean, once again, I'm gonna keep saying that out loud mm -hmm. because they're coming, folks. Mm -hmm. CBDC, central mm -hmm. bank digital currency, mm -hmm. is coming. Which is once again, if you have real money, matter of fact, here, matter of fact, check so, him out. Check him out real fast. Yeah, this right here, uh, physical dollar will now be a central. Dollar, a digital dollar will be CBDCs. He ain't yes. gonna rip it up on camera. I, I, I just knew he, he was. gonna rip it up uh, on I, camera. I, 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 hey, you know it's a federal offense to rip the money. Yeah. Yeah. And we, hey, this is going to the XRP. <laughs> 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 hey, rip it. Hey, right. do right. <laughs> yeah, so, hey, you know, do right. It's called, uh, hey, we talk about investing. I ain't gonna rip up money. I, I'm about about I thought he was about to. I thought he was I going half for the people. I ain't gonna lie. I thought he was I too. I thought he was sure. gonna do it too. Maybe next week on the Mellow for Crypto show, we'll go ahead and rip up some money just to show you that. Cash is trash, <laughs> and the wave of the future is that. crypto pro currency. Yes, Holla sir. at us. It's a matter for crypto show. You already know what it is. You yes, Thank Mr. Green for coming this. through. Money meets LJ Dress City. Yep. You already know what time it is, follow man. Holla at us. Yeah, Next week, crypto. follow us all all platforms.